the way they usually look at biomarkers is to take uh, a group of patients and look at those biomarkers and see if they predict um, hemorrhage or um, whether the patient's going to have another stroke or what's going to happen to them. That's basically what you use it for. Okay. The problem is that the biomarkers are only good if they tell you something in addition to what you already know. <laughs> so, um, I mean, sure, you, if you have a patient who is paralyzed on one side and he can't talk, the biomarkers are going to show abnormalities, but you already knew that. It's no help to you. It's only a help to you if you have patients in whom you don't know and it's additive. So the way the research needs to be done is to take patients in which the clinical examination is not very helpful, all the things we now do are not very helpful, and then see if the biomarkers will help. That's been done, by the way, to some extent in people with head injuries. Because in head injuries, the, the imaging is not as helpful as it is in stroke. And so biomarkers can tell you how badly off the patient is. But of course, in a lot of those patients, you know they're badly off, they're out cold. <laughs> they don't talk to you and there's no surprise that the biomarkers show a lot of trouble. So you know, a lot of these things are done um, in vacuum of just the biomarkers without you know, figuring out what else is going on with the patient. I don't think the advances are gonna be in biomarkers. I just, because the, the technology and the ability to see the patient in detail with people who know about it um, is, is now uh, sophisticated enough that the biomarkers to me don't really help very much. I think the advances are gonna be to train more people. See, we, they, at the turn of the century, there were no stroke doctors, very few, to train more people who have experience and have the know-how to have the patients get to the places where they do have the experience and the know-how, and then we can take very good care of them now. But out in East Podunk, just getting a, a biomarker which shows something is not gonna be any help.